Hi everybody, my name is Holly. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So I thought a good first video would be a what is in my three month old diaper bag. So I'm a first time mom of a beautiful little three month old. Her name is Dixie. Right now she is hopefully asleep in the living room. So I figured I'd come in her room real quick do a little what's in our diaper bag, kind of show you guys what I keep. And yeah, so let's get right into it. So this is the diaper bag that I have been using. It is from Amazon. Um, I will leave a link to it down below in the description box. They had a black one, this brown one, and then like a gray, they call it khaki color. Um, I personally really liked the brown one, so that's the one that I purchased. It's got lots of pockets, so we have um, this front pocket here, and then this zipper pouch is like a way into the bag, along with this top one. There are two pockets on both sides, um, and these are insulated pockets. We have two D-rings here, um, backpack straps, and then a button pouch and a zipper pouch. So, um, in this back pouch here, I have the extra straps that it comes with. So it comes with these two stroller straps. So all of these attach to the D-rings that are um, here on the sides. And these are for looping around the stroller handles or a shopping cart handle. Um, so you can just hang your bag off of the buggy or the stroller. Super useful. Um, this was one of the must-haves for diaper bags whenever I was looking. I really wanted to have stroller straps. Next, it comes with this longer adjustable strap. And this, um, you can wear crossbody if you want. You can wear it just throw it over your shoulder. I use it depending on my mood. Most of the time, I just like the backpack. It's just easier. Gets my arms free for the baby. So this one doesn't get used as much. Um, and then normally in the back snap pocket here, and then this front pouch, that's where I keep my things. So um, my wallet, keys, phone, chapstick, all that stuff in there. Um, when I don't have Dixie, I carry a purse, but I don't wanna carry a purse and a diaper bag because I just feel like that's a lot to be toting around so it's just easier for me to just throw my things in those pockets um and then the last right normally i keep bottles in these side pouches but since we're at home i don't have any bottles in there and then attached to this d-ring i have an itsy ritzy itsy ritzy passy pouch and i just have a cutie pat flat pacifier Dixie doesn't really like passies. She would rather just chew on her hand. I don't know why. Not gonna question it, but she just <laughs> does not like a passy. But I just, she started the teeth a little bit, so it's nice to keep it and have it just in case. So inside the bag, there, well you can't see. <laughs> the first thing in the bag is just a little fuzzy blanket since it's February. It's chilly outside, so it is nice to just keep a blanket on hand. Um, so there are three pockets on this back side. There's a zipper pocket and then two open pouches. You can't really see the other one. It's way down here. There are two pouches on either side. And then on this inner flap here, there is a pouch. So um, I'll start in the back pouches. So in the zippered compartment, I just have some nail clippers. She doesn't sit still for me to clip her nails because she's only three months old. So I have them in, I have a pair in the diaper bag, a pair at home. So when she is sitting still, I can just quickly clip them. In the next pocket, I keep extra clothes. So we have an extra pair of socks and we have an extra sleeper. These are my favorite sleepers. They are the Cloud Island, I think. Yeah, the Cloud Island ones from Target. Um, they zip from the top 
or sorry, they zip from the bottom so that that way when you're changing the di her diaper, you don't have to unzip the top and leave them completely cold. And then also the back of the feet have this little like cinch. So it keeps the foot on them rather than the ones that don't where they're really loose and their foot will like travel up. Um, because of this, it keeps their foot inside of the little footing which is very nice. So in the pocket in front of that one, I have, um, these are fruit flavored passy wipes. They are disinfectant. Um, so they, if a passy falls on the floor, falls on a dirty surface, um, I can just whip one of these out and clean her passy off. And then we have these diaper disposal bags. These are great for, um, if she soils in her, like her clothes, just throw them in here so they don't ruin the rest of the bag. Um, some people don't like diapers in their trash can. This eliminates the smell and it also like contains the diaper in a bag. So people that don't like it feel a little bit more comfortable with that. Um, so into the side pockets, the first one is diaper rash cream and the little spatula to apply it. Dixie doesn't really get diaper rash. I think she's had it once and I got it taken care of pretty quickly. So, but it's nice to have on hand. So in the next pouch, we have this water bottle that has uh, nursery water in it just to fill up her bottles. It's nice to just have this and not have to worry about, oh my goodness, where am I gonna find water? Spit up cloth is also in that pocket. This is a must have for a teething baby because the drool and the spit up that comes with a teething baby is insane. Um, so the last pocket to go through is the very front, like inside pocket. And that just has her um, changing pad because I don't like putting her just raw on a changing table. Um, I like to protect her from the germs. So, that's it for the pockets. So into like the main compartment of the bag, the first thing that we have is this little deer um, rattle. She loves like little noises like this. So this is nice to have in here. She can't really like grab it and play with it yet herself because she is still so young. Um, but this super cute, be very nice whenever she gets a little bit bigger and can play with it herself. Um, next I have this Munchkin formula holder. This is great because you can just um, portion out the formula into here and the top spins. So you can just open it and dump it into the bottle. I can hear her starting to fuss a little bit. Next, we've got a must have diapers. Lots of diapers. <laughs> can never have too many diapers. And then I think this is the last thing in the bag. Just this cute little flower wipes holder. I really like using a wipes holder just because I feel like I don't need one of the like big packs of wipes in here whenever I can just take out a few, put them in here and then just refill it. So yes. And I don't know where this is from. My mom got it from me, got it for me. It's probably from like Target or Walmart. It's where we do most of our shopping. But yeah, so that is what is in my diaper bag. Baby's fussing, so I should probably take care of her. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, feel free to give it a thumbs up. You can also subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.